the blueprint Sleeping rage and youth till exuberance Everybody loves the wood for a nuisance Hit the earth like an asteroid Need nothing but you Rock that, 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 rock the line on tomb Do you fraudulent Inject that collagen From your heart to your car Pull up Diamond Billy shining with the bangles out I don't see, but you guys are not spiritual. That's why it's so hard for you to believe this when it shouldn't be. Okay? Let's go ahead to the next example, man. This is a guy named Oliver Francis. <laughs> now, this guy acts like a real nigga right here, this one. But check it out. Hennessy bottle, man. Right. <laughs> well, I say, you know, but check it out. Check it out. They don't live with your bitch, but you know what it is. You know what it is. Don't let them know on the switch. They switch with a blood to my lips. Blood to my lips. I guess the fuck who you with? Who you with? I'm out of your bitch. I'm out of your bitch. I'm about to color the shit that we sipping. I'm a fucking whip. I'm a fucking whip. I'm in a whip with a bitch with my dick and a blood to my lips. A blood to my lips. Fucking a bitch with a gold on my dick and a gold on my wrist. A gold on my wrist. Maybe a fuck around, spend me a quarter million on my crib. Turn around town and said Ali and Cloud was just over this shit. Over this shit. Turn around town and said Ali is told me it's in no clip. Turn around town and said I got that little baby in my bitch. Hey man, look, look, look at these guys, man. Look at them. Look at the way they act. That's not the typical Edomite. The typical Edomite is stiff, and the typical Edomite, when they party and when they get together, they don't act like that, man. If you ever grew up in this world and you was around Esau, like really around them, and how they act, you don't have Edomites like the, the, your your regular Edomite don't act that way. That's the way Jake act when they get around. And then you hear the lyrics that he was saying. He was saying the typical nigga shit. Mm -hmm. oh. The only difference is, is he don't have the pigment because his uh, forefathers mingled amongst the nations, man. Oh. And just like the brother brought out in Psalms, the one hundred six chapter. Actually, let me just go ahead and um dig into that through the spirit. And before I go into the um, the entirety of um, this lesson, I want to go ahead and give all honor, glory, and praises to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rechakwadash. Double honors to the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone who rule well, who taught me the truth. Salutations to the hopeful elect, you brothers out there on the globe. All right. Pushing this truth and teaching it with all righteousness and sincerity. You Israelites scattered abroad, so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay, scattered abroad. All right, and to you, few sincere sisters who hearken as well. To you, I say shalom. You know, this is um, I might as well just go ahead and call this another installment of uh, Jake or Fake. This is actually the video that I first saw around the time when I when I first found out about the word some odd years ago. That um, that made me like really receive. You know, at the time, you know what I'm saying. That, that even the elders was calling them confusion of face and things of that nature you know um i still don't know a hundred percent what's up with that um with that decree because I, I can't find a video lord's willing a brother or somebody will find a video for me or maybe i find it or i'll come across it later on in life and stuff like that i haven't seen a decree where we can't call them confusion of face anymore but i you know like having haven't heard somebody break it down in the video that i was watching it makes sense because the word confusion, it does mean shame. And it is a shame to not know your heritage. Is it not? Right? But in any wise, this is the book of Psalms, chapter 106. I believe we started at verse 32. 
Yeah, Khan. Yep, he did. Khan. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 106, verse 32. It says, They angered him also at the waters of strife, so that it went ill with Moses for their sakes. You know, like the brother said, he's talking about the children of Israel. Because you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, we've angered the Heavenly Father with our idolatry, with our rebelliousness, okay? With all of our maliciousness, you know, our, our thick-headedness, you know? Verse 33, it says, because they provoked his spirit so that he spake unadvisedly with his lips. Yeah, and that's, and that's what Jake, just, that, oh, 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 hold up, hold up. Are we? Hey, because that's Jake, bro. Like, is, is Jake not a provocateur, man? Jake is Jake is so strong in his provocatory nature, man. Let me see if I can find it. Lord, please let me find it. Um, oh, Khan, this is the book of First Corinthians, chapter ten, verse twenty-two. It says, "Do we provoke the Lord to jealousy? Are we stronger than He?" And you know what the scriptures say about jealousy, man. Okay, what well, how how jealousy is to a man. Okay. This is the Apostle Paul to the to the brothers in Corinth. All right. Again, this is why we say the to the brothers scattered abroad. It says, do we provoke the Lord to jealousy? Are we stronger than he? Yeah. Are you stronger than the Lord for you to be saying, oh, the Lord need to come down and talk to me? Oh, I uh, not. Nah, I, I ain't doing nothing until the Lord come speak to me and things of that nature. Because Jake, Jake is uh, look, Jake is a damn nigga, man. Jake, Jake got a, a, a vile, arrogant, twisted mindset, man. Okay, and this is even before Esau Edom started ruling over our people, whether you want to receive it or not. You know, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, we've been rebellious since the beginning of time, man. Hence Adam and Eve. All right, but I'm not going to go into all of that because that's not the point, man. All right. Look, of course he got angered at us and he cast us away from his presence at that one point in time, you know, but now we're coming back. All right. Psalms 106 and 35, it says, it's like you. Verse 33, it says, because they provoked his spirit so that he spake unadvisedly with his lips. They did not destroy the nations concerning whom the Lord commanded them. Yeah, if the Lord... If, if we was if we was in the midst of war or if we was going to war with another nation and the Lord said, you better destroy their nation. Don't take none of their goods. Don't take none of their women. Go, go, go destroy them. Don't take anything from them. Just go look, go, go take them down. Go stop them and uh, go stop them until I tell you to cease. You know, if the Lord tell you to do something, damn it, you do it, man. All right. Verse 34 says they did not destroy the nations. Concerning whom the Lord commanded them, but, okay, but were mingled among the heathen and learned their works. You know, and as the brother was saying in the video, Jake has a long history of intermingling himself with the heathen nations. That's why when people come to camp, you cannot, you cannot, uh, um, you, you, like, you can't, you can't repel them away with this whole, oh, you only Israelite if you got dark skin and, and woolly hair, because that's not true. That's not true at all. And the Lord, the Lord is going to see you guys for that, man. All right? Sending away brothers and sisters like that. You can't do that. All right? It says, but we're mingled among the heathen and learned their works. That's why we got brothers and sisters that look like the other nations. The Like, like yo, and I I need to, and I, I'm because I'm, I know I'm being a sloth, man. You know, I need to bring out these these uh these these so called uh Korean artists more. All of this K pop and, and, and uh Korean um music culture that's been coming out, you know, widely over the past few years, because a lot of them, if not all of them, are Jakes. Okay, and I did I did a few videos on them, you know what I'm saying? The uh the, the brothers and sisters that look like, you know, the, the so called Koreans and Chinese and Japanese. That be making rap videos and, and uh, uh, these R&B songs and things of that nature. Because I sincerely believe in my spirit that they are Israelites. All right. We're going to have brothers and sisters that, that look like 
the other nations again you know um what is that I went too far down daniel 9 and 7 O lord righteousness belongeth unto thee but unto us confusion of faces as at this day to the men of judah and to the inhabitants of jerusalem and unto all israel that are near and that are far off through all the countries whither thou has driven them because of their trespass that they have trespassed against thee and did not that happen okay was not israel the so-called negroes latinos the native americans were we not scattered abroad because of our trespass the lord said that that would happen and i'm gonna get that scripture in a little bit but let me um let me get this in the my sword bible at um daniel 9 and 7 confusion confusion yeah con this is the word this is the um the hebrew word for the word confusion um I'm not I'm not too savvy with, with the Assyrian Hebrew Salakia, but it says um Bosheth. It says shame. Shame, shameful thing. Okay. It says Bosheth. And I also know that uh, I, I can tell you that the word Babal, alright, what or, or that 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 um that Babylon, okay, comes from the word Babal, it does mean confusion or shame. And that's exactly what 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 it is when you don't follow and hearken unto the words of the heavenly Father. All right, you become ashamed to Him, and that's exactly what the entirety of Israel, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, the Native Americans, became a shame unto Israel. I mean, a shame unto the heavenly Father, Salakia. All right. So we receive a, a shame of of faces, man. That's why you see Jake walking around, indulging in. The habits of the heathen are right, worshiping the other idols and gods. Uh, their their other um their idols and gods, which are no gods, all right, and don't and don't uh, and don't have the understanding of the heavenly Father and the Son, all right. Verse eight it says, "O Lord, to us belongeth confusion of face to our kings, to our princes, and to our fathers, because we have sinned against thee." So I wouldn't be surprised if a brother in another country. Okay, a, a, a brother in another um a, a country among the another uh among the other nations, you know what I'm saying was was deemed as an elder or an apostle, and things of that nature. All right, that that may that may look like one of the other nations uh, um um figures, man. Okay, it ain't no surprise that if you see a brother that look like a so-called Edomite or a so-called uh, a, a Korean, a so-called Chinese. Or whatever the case is, and he's pushing the word, or he has a Bible in his hand, and he's pushing the word sincerely of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah. It ain't no surprise, you know. This is the Lord's doing, man. And these brothers that look like the other nations is a stumbling block to you, and let it be so because you, hey, <laughs> Isaiah six and nine. <laughs> All right, um, what is it? Deuteronomy chapter four, verse twenty-seven. And the Lord shall scatter you among the nations, and ye shall be left few in number among the heathen, whither the Lord shall scatter, uh, Salakia, whither the Lord shall lead you. Yeah, and that's exactly what the Lord did, because we went off. We went off serving these other idols, these other gods of the other nations. And you know, Jake being a damn, the, the simp that he is, you know, Jake went and started popping, a, the, popping these heathen women. And the heathen women introduced them to the, to their um to their uh, to their idols and their gods. Look at what happened to Samson. <laughs> hey, women are strong, man. They're very persuasive, very manipulative. It's not hard to get persuaded by a woman. Okay, but that's even more a uh, reason why you need to believe in the more uh, in the Lord more, you know. But that's not the topic of this lesson. It says. Deuteronomy 4 and 27 and the Lord shall scatter you among the nations and ye shall be left few in number among the heathen whether the Lord shall scatter you uh, whether the Lord shall lead you and there you shall serve God's the work of men's hands wood and stone which neither see nor hear nor eat nor smell and that's exactly what's going on today I'm gonna get this one last scripture and then I'm gonna close out 
Hosea 1 and 10. Yet the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea, which cannot be measured nor number. Okay, and can you can you literally like can you really measure sand? Okay, meaning can you um can you count how many grains of sand that you have in your hand? You know, and then looking at sand, you see that the the many different particles of sand they're of uh different different color browns, man. Because when you look at sand as a whole, it's, it's it, it could be like real real uh, uh, uh light or real real dark. You got white sand, you got brown sand, you got black sand. Okay, but even more so, it's the number of the sand, and that's how the nation of Israel is. We're scattered abroad. You, you, you won't know who's a Jake until until Yahabashim Yahusha declares, "Oh, well, this brother is a Jake." Did you know that this brother was a Jake? This brother was a Jake. That brother is a Jake. Okay, or that brother is a brother, if you will. You know, talking about the men of the elect. Even um uh, guys in the world, man, these Israelites in the world. I just recently did a video talking about Justin Bieber. I believe he's an Israelite. Okay. It says, yet the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea, which cannot be measured nor numbered. And it shall come to pass that in the place where it was said unto them, ye are not my people, all right, in our captivity, the main captivity, which is America, Babylon, are spiritually called Babylon, Sodom and Gomorrah, and Egypt, according to the Holy Bible, that in the place where it was said unto them, ye are not my people, there it shall be said unto them, ye are the sons of the living God. Okay, we are the sons of the, of the living power. You know, in the same place where the Lord cast us away to, in that same place, you know, the Lord said, he 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 he's gonna claim us as his sons again, and that's exactly what he's been doing, all right, through the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone and their elders before them. You know, but that's all I wanted to bring out on that. I was just I was excited to do this video because this is the first video that that really like made me accept, you know what I'm saying, quote unquote confusion in the face or Israelite foreigners because. I listen to I listen to a lot of music, man. Not not so much, not so much now. You know, it, it's it's like every hearing here here and there again, or whatever. Like I may listen to rock, rap. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, K-pop, K-hip, whatever the whatever the hell, man. You know, I listen to music here and there, but it's 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 not like watching videos. You know, so I could get an understanding. I can't get an understanding from the music of the world. But with that being said, call Allah and Allah, Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Hashem, Rechak, Wadash. Hey, be spiritual, man. Shalom.